Well, I don't know what to tell you, but let's go run a couple more tests and I'll show you the temperature of the air coming out of the nozzle. It's this kind of morning this morning. Currently feels like minus 26 degrees Celsius outside. Let's see how nice and warm it is in the garage. I am sucking air from outside, warming it up and putting it in the garage. So far it's been working just fine that way. I've got two of them this time and we'll see what temp comes out of that out. So the infrared is telling me that it is coming out at 92.6 degrees. Now let's try this one out. This is the one I use on my pizza oven. It's fairly accurate. There you go, pretty much coming out at 90 degrees. It's pretty much 10 degrees colder than it was last time I did this test and the temperature is coming out of that outlet the exact same thing pretty much that it did last time. I've also had absolutely no issues with the diesel whatsoever. Somehow in all of this I forgot where I live and diesel's treated here so it was a non-issue the whole time. Yes, having it inside probably would be a lot more efficient, but it's not the route I chose. I didn't want to hear that ticking sound. Uh, it would be very echoey inside that garage, and it's working out just fine for me so far. I only usually use it during the day when I'm here. I don't let this thing run overnight. I don't like letting it run unattended. I do trust the heater. I just don't need this place heated when I'm not in it.